Greetings everyone. In today's video, we will quickly learn how you can easily configure new website or migrate your current website to Cloudways. Let's get started. For more contents like this, please subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon. Let me open the browser and search for Cloudways. This is the site, click on it. Cloudways offers great hosting and is super easy to use. And it also offers a 3-day free trial so you can evaluate before purchasing. Anyway, let me register for Cloudways. Click on start here. Give your first name, last name, email ID, set up a password and choose the relevant options for you. Agree the terms and start here. Let me close this. After registering, the first thing you want to do is verify your account. Enter your phone number, send SMS, enter the OPT and verify. Now verify email ID. I will resend the email. So check your mail. Let me log into my Gmail. So you will receive an email from Cloudways and simply activate your account. So the account has been activated. Let me refresh the space. Let me close this and close this too. Anyway, let's get started. Now here are a couple of servers you can choose from. Choose whichever is feasible for you. I will go with the digital ocean and choose the appropriate size you want. Cloudways allows multiple sites to be hosted on the same server. Depending from where you receive the most visitors, choose the relevant server. And click on launch now. Now Cloudways will add a server for you. It takes up to 7 minutes but you will have a website made already. So now the server is ready, as you can see. Now if you go to Applications and click here, your website is actually ready. And you can customize themes and everything. Now let's find the login details of the website. For that, again go to the servers. Now again if you click on your server here, then you will find the master credentials which can be used for SFTP. We'll come back to this later. And here are other tools too if you want to explore. But we will go to managing the website for now. Now simply click on www and your application. Here you will find all the details of your website. Now this link is basically your site as you saw earlier. And here are other credentials required. Let's log into the WordPress dashboard slash WP admin. Then here's the username and password. Let me copy this. Let me copy the password. So you can see we are in the dashboard with the latest WordPress 5.9.3 and you can easily customize it. For instance, let me add a theme. Add a theme. Upload theme. Choose file. I have this info theme here purchased from ThemeForest, but you can use any themes. Open and install. Activate the theme. It's activated. Let me quickly import a demo. Let me choose a simple one, click to import, so it's done. Now let me check the website. So you can see we have created a brand new website on Cloudways and it was very quick. Now you can customize this site as you want. Here is the database access of the website. Let me launch the database manager. So here you can access your database. 
You can also import or export the database and use it as a backup. You can also access all the website files and folders using SFTP. For that, you can either use master credentials we navigated earlier or create a username and password here. Let me create one, add a username and password and click on add. Now to access all the website files, we need another software called FileZilla. Search for FileZilla. This is the site. Directly go to download the FileZilla client. Click to download. Download this one. So it's downloaded. Let me install it. So the installation is done. Let's launch it. Now to access all the site files, go to Files, Site Manager, create a new site, give any name you want. Make sure to choose SFTP here. In the host, copy this IP address, port use 22 and use the username and password we created earlier. And connect. OK. OK. And here are all your website files. Go to public underscore HTML. So here are all your website files and folders. You can edit these files here or take a manual backup. So this is how you can use SFTP on Cloudways. Let me close this. Now we need to change the website URL. Basically, this one with our own custom domain. For that, go to Domain Management and enter the domain you want to use. Please make sure you have purchased the domain and save changes. So the domain has been added. If I go to access details, you can see it's our domain name here. Now we need to point the domain name to Cloudways. If I click on the domain, it displays nothing. So for that, we need to change the e-records of the domain from where you have purchased it. I will quickly show you how you can change the A-records. Log into your domain provider and here you will have the option to change the A-records. If you have a cPanel, then log into your cPanel, then click on Join Editor. Find your domain name and click on Manage and click on Add Records. Use at here, if that's not permitted, write the domain URL. And on the IP address, simply copy this. And paste it here. And add records. So a new A record has been added. Please note, this A record changes might take some time to apply worldwide. Anyway, let me check if the site is working or not, so the IP changes haven't been reflected here in Nepal. Let me try with the VPN. We will come to this HTTPS error in a while. Click on Advanced and proceed for now. So you can see the website has been created on Cloudways. Please note, you do not need to use VPN to view sites. The A records will take some time to work globally. Now let's resolve this SSL certificate error. Go back to Cloudways and click here. Let's use let's encrypt at the domain name. Use an email address and install certificate. So the SSL certificate has been added and it's set to auto renewal. 
so you can see the certificate has been added to the website. Now after all this, go to backup and restore and take the backup now. This is for the safety purposes. So this is how easily you can create a new website using Cloudways. Now let's quickly see how we can migrate a website to Cloudways. For example, we will migrate this website which is hosted on other servers. In order to do so, go to the site's dashboard wp-admin, enter the credentials. So we are on the dashboard, go to plugins and add new and search for Cloudways WordPress Migrator, install and activate the plugin. Enter the Cloudways email and agree the terms and click on migrate. So we will require these details from Cloudways. So let us log into Cloudways, go to cloudways.com, log in and enter the credentials. Now if we click here and go to applications, so this is for our earlier website which we do not want to replace. So let's add a new site. So click on application and go to add application, choose the server, so add application and choose WordPress, give a name and add application. So what we did is we added another website on the same server. Cloudways allows multiple sites on the same server as long as the size is good. You won't be charged per website anyway, so it will take some time to add another WordPress application. So the application has been added. Go to application. This is the new one. Click on it. So this is another WordPress site on Cloudways and here are all the details we need. Now to migrate our website, destination URL is simply this link. Copy and paste it. SFTP host address is this IP, copy it. Here's the database name, copy here. SFTP username. Let me create a user here by adding username and password. And add. Let me copy the username and the password. HTTP will leave it to default root directory no site password no and click on migrate the migration will take time depending upon the size of the website anyway so it's done we now have to connect the domain enable ssl and other settings let me go to cloudways so you can see our website has been migrated to cloudways domain as you can see it was very easy now let's log into the backend of the site. You can use the same login details as before because we transfer the database too. So this site works all good. Now let's change this URL to ours. For that, go to domain management, add our domain name here and save changes. If you go to access details, you can see the domain is added here. Now we need to change the A records of the domain. Let me close this all. Now log in from where you purchased the domain from. Go to domains and click on modify Jones and add the A records. Use at the rate or the website URL here. Copy the IP address and paste it here and add record so it has been added if you see the a records with an old ip please delete that too so it's all done here let me close them all we need to configure the ssl certificate for it too anyway let's proceed to see if the site works So the site has been migrated successfully and very easily. Now let's quickly configure SSL. Go to SSL certificate 
add the email ID and your domain name and install certificate. So this certificate has also been enabled. Make sure auto renewal is enabled. So you can see the site now has the SSL certificate. By the way, you can also access all the files of this site via SFTP as we did it earlier. So this is how you can easily migrate your site from any server to Cloudways. We really hope this video is useful. Thank you very much.